What was that? I didn't even get a good look at it. No! <laughs> that was so cool! We need a hundred more horror games like this. Hi everybody, welcome back. My name's Olivia and I'm so glad that you're here. Today, we're going to be doing things slightly different than normal. We're going to be playing several scary games back to back. A few of them were recorded a little while ago, so if you notice a few differences in like lighting or hair or shirt or a slightly disjointed introduction, no you don't. You're seeing things again and you should get that checked out. Today we're starting with Bloody Room, which is a short indie horror game set in a gruesome house. Beyond starting with this one, I'm not sure what order I'll edit these into, so stick around to find out. If you're ready, I'm ready. Let's play some scary games. Here we go! So far, standard horror game. Oh, a complimentary flashlight. Does that help with the complimentary blurriness? Not really. We'll see. Complimentary creepy family photos. I, I'm pretty sure they're never actually this family's photos. It's just the weirdo who lives here collects them. Complimentary locked door. Wait a minute. Good grief, that's a lot of gnats. Can I suggest... Oh, you want to you wanna open up now? That's okay, because I have a suggestion for you. How about you try one of those bug zapper things indoors? Oh, I can't. Are you, are you singing, or is that the radio? We walk so slowly. It is horrific. It is raining. It's raining. Okay, okay. Is that the same door? We just, no, it's not, because there would have been a little credenza thing. I don't know what a credenza is. I'm just talking. If I didn't say it right, don't correct me. We walk very slowly. We are walking like a person that's scared. Um. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. I was gonna, I was gonna comment on it. <gasps> okay. Hey, 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 hey. I was fully expecting. I was fully expecting this to be like a circle around. Why am I so scared it just started? Did you leave me a note? Are they walking behind us? Don't walk up behind me. Forgive me, Maria. Forgive me, Rose. Hey, 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 hey. Is that who we're being haunted by, probably? I'm all for forgiveness. What is all over the ground? Like, no, really. What is... What is this? I'm going to, oh, okay, pretend that this is dirt because that makes me feel better. I don't know why, because if it's dirt, it's probably dead bodies, but. Mm. Oh, there's no way out of here. I'll take that, thank you. Bathroom key, I don't want to go. I don't want to go, I don't want to go in the bathroom. I don't want to go into the bathroom. I don't have to use the bathroom. I already used the bathroom before we got here. I'm brave. We're brave, we can do this. You walk like a person who is scared, but also I feel like I would walk at a pace a little bit quicker than this. That is, that's a weird bite to have in the house. This is like a bunker. That's not like a garage. This is like a serial killer's bunker. Maybe the people who we need forgiveness from are the people we murdered in our bunker and hey open up oh oh close it close it up close it up that is a lot of blood you would have to really it is everywhere it it whatever happened messed up the tile i mean the tile looks like it's messed up to begin with um why am i having trouble talking it's normally not this bad how did you get it like either that's from the murder or you need to go see a gastroenterologist because if you're if, if you're doing that you've got a problem oh yep probably from the murder i can't go any closer can i no there's a body in that bag we murdered them 
We straight up, we straight up murdered them. So whatever happens to us, I feel like we definitely deserve this. Here we go. Ooh, please. Just be gentle. Be gentle with me. It's not my first paranormal, but I don't want- Oh, hey, 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 die. Oh, oh. Yeah, I have a feeling that dying is the direction in which this is going. Hey, hey, what's wrong? Hi. Do I have an option to not? Probably, probably not. Okay, can I have a second? Can I have a second? I'm so sorry for what happened to you. Get this man or woman and or child. I don't know how old they are. Get them. Whatever happened to you was horrific. Unless nothing happened to you and you're crazy. But I, I'm thinking we were a killer. Come on. Mm, mm. It's coming! Ooh. It was coming. It was coming. We knew it was coming. We knew it was coming. Mm. Mm. But when's the next one coming? I don't know. Door? Forgive me. For what did you do? What did you do, you freak? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, are we gonna PT it and everything goes back to normal? You're gonna make me turn around. You're gonna make me turn around and she's gonna... Are you there? Hi? Hi, are you there? Hello? There is a lot of trash bags, I just noticed that. How many people do we need forgiveness from? And or angry spirits do we need forgiveness from? Oh, hey, we're back at the beginning. We're, we've made such great progress. Okay. We are going to thug it out. Unless there's an option to leave. And then we're going to not thug it out. It just sounds like someone's pitter-pattering around me. Unless it's my small pitter-patter feet. Just, just the rain. It's just the rain. It's just raining. Yeah, it, it's gonna lead back to here, isn't it? I'm not going back into the murder garage. Their body, there's bodies under those dirts. Oh, lordy. Forgive me. There goes the door. Ooh. Maria Rose, any other number of bodies in the trash bags? Yes, please forgive me. That's the handwriting of a person who needs forgiveness. And I don't feel like you're gonna offer it to me kindly. Why? You might as well sit down in the corner and wait to die. Okay. We don't have to be awful about this, though. You can just kill me in my sleep. Please. Ah! And I saw it coming, too. She's giggling. She's so, she's so thrilled with the outcome and my terror. I saw it coming. It still got me. I'm not a thug. I'm gonna have to revoke my thug status. In October 27, 2004, an American woman, Maria, was murdered by her husband, Alberto, because she wanted to leave him for a reason. That's a little vague, but still sad. Oh, uh, I didn't expect this. His frequent abuse of her ended her life, leaving the woman with so many injuries and malnourishment. The husband locked her in the bathroom for days until the 13-year-old daughter, Rose, found her corpse. How do I have a talent for picking the most depressing horror games? I don't know. The daughter intended to call for help, and while she was calling for help, her father was already in the house, so she ran to the exit door. Unfortunately, her father got her. I told you there was too many trash bags. The father decided to drown his daughter in a bathtub. Then she died immediately. After killing his wife and daughter, he hanged himself in his bedroom. I thought I heard rope creaking, but that was the garage. Is this the garage's bedroom? Maybe this man's a psychopath. That was so depressing. Is the next one gonna be this depressing? I don't know. I told you I don't know the order. Buckle up. Why? Why'd you do that to me? Now I'm sad. We are playing another short indie horror game. This one is called Fear Assessment. If the name is any indication, we're gonna take an assessment and probably be scared by it. If you're ready, I'm ready. Let's play the game. So, the fear assessment is a specialized test developed and implemented by government agencies to collect data on psychological torture techniques and their impact on individuals. What? 
It serves as an essential tool in understanding the effects of fear-based ma manipulation. This test uses your webcam. Oh, great. That's great. Here we go. In order to follow the test to its full extent, you must follow these six rules. I've never been good at following rules, so this is immediately. Leave all doors inside wide open. And your side or my side? I have a... Okay, so there's three doors in this room. There's the little bathroom, there's the hall door, and there's a closet. If I leave the hall door open, you're gonna hear some of the most hee-haw accents you have ever heard in your life because someone is on a Zoom call out there, so I, that's not an option. The bathroom, I'll leave that open. I'm always scared to leave that open when I film in here because it's a little creepy, so that might help up the atmosphere. And the closet, I don't think you can see, so I'll open it, I'll open it. Okay, the doors are open. It would probably help if it wasn't daylight. Oh, no, I don't think it matters. I think it's gonna be creepy either way. Make sure you are alone. Do they count? Do they really count? I don't wanna be alone. So we're gonna say, that we're gonna say they don't count. Turn off all lights. If we did that, you would not be able to see me. And I, also, I can't turn the sun off. Five, stay focused on the test. You're gonna get what you get. And you're gonna be glad. And you're gonna take it. Cause like I said, rolls in me. Six, have a light on your face. Then, are we supposed to turn all the lights out? Make up your mind. You're giving me whiplash. Click anywhere to continue. That is unsettling, and how did I not really notice that until now? That's not good for us. Level one, <laughs> click on the faces. Oh, hi. Is it like timed? Ooh. Ooh, is there, what happens to me if we get it wrong? Mr. Skeleton is just everywhere, just peeking out of all the crevices. That is a face. Ooh, yeah, it's not even an option to click anywhere. Oh my gosh, did it get dimmer? Why am I getting nervous? It's just a little test. It does. I think it's like time. I think you have to do it within a certain amount of time. Hey, 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 hey. Alien? I'm trying to like give myself long enough to think. A hanging man? It's the same one. Uh, B Babadook. I don't know what you are. Just a weirdo in the dark. Jesus. That was not bad. We've taken worse quizzes. I think we've only actually taken one. <laughs> okay. Hit me. We will begin the next level in 10 seconds. That's the actual time. Level two questions and answer. Do you ever feel like you're being watched? Yeah. Probably by you, right now. Hi! Yes? Have you ever heard a voice calling your name but no one was there? Okay, so like, I've seen the TikToks, I've heard the urban legends, I know the stories. If you hear someone call your name and you don't see them, even if it's somebody you know from the other room, you're not supposed to answer. Like, you're inviting spirits and demons and all sorts of nasties into your home. So that is my, that is my life advice for you today. Don't answer unless you, they're in the room and you see them. Yes, I have heard that. And then I've like asked, I'm like, hey, did you call my name? No. And then you're like, well, call a priest. I'm dead. We're done for. Pay attention. Thank God I had my energy drink today. Listen to the voices. Your ears are lying to you. The people are not real. Yeah, I figured the ones from the photos were in. Your senses are deceiving. You are ill. I didn't feel great this weekend, but and they will fix you? They are coming inside the room. Stay still. I can see in the camera. I don't see anyone but Marie and a dog butt. You've got very straight teeth. If a figure were to appear in the corner of the room, you would scream, cry, pray, or run. Pray for them because, hold on, I would either do one of two things. I would hit them with this bat that I got when I had to stay home alone for like several nights. Um, it was supposed to be, I did some research, it was supposed to do some real damage if you ever needed to hit anyone. So, that, and that's a hefty bat. So, you have to be prepared for situations like this. I would probably scream, if I can get to my bat, get my bat. If the dog's there to throw the dog at them, I would throw the dog. Grab the dog on my way out as I run out. Um, probably scream. Immediately scream. Have you ever thought about being tortured to death? I'm gonna be honest with you right now. 
full complete honesty no and I would like to never have to think about that ever do you fear the concept of an afterlife no I think when my time comes the sweet release of death is gonna be really nice no do you have loved ones what are you gonna do to them don't touch them yes do you care for animals okay <laughs> it's gonna sound like I don't because I said I'm gonna throw my dog at him like I said I'm going to pick my dog up as I as I run out so it's just like what it would be super confusing for the intruder to have a dog thrown at their face. I'm not leaving my dog. My dog's just a part of the puzzle of for us to escape. It's okay. They know the drill. We've practiced this. Yes. I'm so good at tests. Level three, which one? <laughs> dog or baby? How much time do I have? Oh, it's okay. It's just fading in and out. Um. I'm going with dog, and I don't care what you think. You play, you take your own fear assessment. I'm dog. That was a mistake. No, they just killed the baby. I'm not going down for that. Level four, listen. Press space if you can't handle the audio. I don't hear anything yet. I don't hear anything yet. Is this gonna like deafen me? Yeah, no, I hear it now. I hear it now. Style up internet. Oh, it's the baby crying. We're getting haunted because we killed the baby. I wasn't gonna kill the dog. Also, I didn't know the baby was gonna die. I'm not not going down for that. We're not we're not we're not wussies. We can handle we can handle any audio they throw at us. I'm not spacing out. The wailing of the dam. It does hurt my brain a little on this side, but it's not unbearable. It's it's just kind of like they didn't get the sweetest of releases for their afterlife. They're I don't know what they did. Maybe they killed a baby in a fear assessment. That's why they're screaming like that. We don't know anyone like that who might have made that mistake. I wasn't gonna kill a dog again. I'm not. It's like one lone person breathing now. How much worse is it gonna get? It's not gonna like deafen us, I don't think. This is beautiful. I have one of those sun like rising up alarm clocks and. There's birds that chirp in the morning, so this is just like, oh, this isn't so bad. I, I listen to this every day. It's trapped though. I'm trying to lull us into a false sense of security. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh. The leaves are rustling? Or someone digging a grave? Or is it waves? I can't, I don't know. Oh no, oh no, that's what I was waiting for. I don't even know what to say about this one. what I imagine getting sucked up into a UFO light would sound like. Yeah. That's how I would describe this one. <laughs> you had to sit there and describe all of these sounds. That's what I would call this one. UFO suckage uppage. What if the rest of the test is just this? It's just these sounds. The scariest thing about the open closet is how messy it is. And the fact that I will never clean it. And the scariest thing about the bathroom is that it's just a creepy bathroom. It's just outdated. Oh, that was it. We've done it. How many levels are there? We escaped with our hearing intact. Will it? Will it? What's the twist ending? What is the ending of the twist? 
I think that was it. Okay. Did we pass? Hey, 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 hey. Who's whispering at me? How do you eat your mouth that wide? Doesn't that hurt? I heard cannibalism and doorstep. We did it. Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams, everybody. All right, guys, that was fear assessment. I don't think I'm gonna be having sweet dreams tonight. I am apparently getting a cannibal on my doorstep. I don't know what else they said, but I definitely heard that part. Do you think that you're also going to be getting a cannibal on your doorstep since we both shared in this experience together? All right, guys, our next horror game is called The Horror Within. I had to check this out with you guys because supposedly we are playing a horror game within a horror game. I love weird meta stuff like this, so I just had to check this out with you guys. Here we go. Okay. I can't fall asleep. I should get some cereal. Place bowl on table. I love super direct instructions like that. Like, please just tell me what you want from me. Ooh, we are sprinting. We are sprinting. Do we... Can you, like... Hold on a second. Hold on. Let me get, like, a... Gotta start at the starting line. Good grief. Yeah, no. There's gonna be a running element to this, and I'm gonna cry. Gosh. Pick up bowl. I can do that. That's pretty simple. Where's the table? Oh. 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 Here. Did you... Do you have a dining table as a desk? I bet that's kind of expensive. That's an expensive choice. Pick up cereal. It didn't say pick up the cereal, but I'm going to do it anyways. Now what? Do I need to get a, sp a, sp a spoon? A spawn? Where would that be? In the sink? In the, in the oven? In the, what's obviously the dishwasher? What do I do? Did you want me to put it over here and I already screwed it up? What do I do now? Can I leave? I messed it up, guys. Guys, I'm so sorry. Oh. That's a fancy fridge that can go right through me. Okay. I didn't mess it up. Don't worry about it. It's fine. I told you not to worry. Maybe I should play that new horror game that I bought yesterday. You don't just launch into it. You gotta, like, gear yourself up. No normal, non-psychopathic person goes, I'm ready to play a horror game. You go, I can do this. I can do this. And then you spend five minutes huddled in the corner going like this. You just work yourself up to it. No one does it like this. It's like the, the pre-gaming ritual. E. Use computer. Hey, 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 hey. Let me look around as much as I want. Oh, gosh. The horror. The horror within. Ugh. Press enter to start. Oh. I don't know what's going to happen. Whatever happens isn't going to be good. Ooh, three. I'm going to die in this game, aren't I? Six. Oh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Three. Please don't chase me. Please don't chase me. Six. Oh god, Jesus, please, no, help me. I can't run. One. We're, we're just guessing, I can't do this. What? E, pick up key. What do I do with this? Oh, it's the door over there. I can't run, so if something chases me, I'm gonna start screaming my head off. Don't like being trapped in mazes with creepy things. Please, end it, end it, end it now. Just kill me. I wonder what the premise. Don't, do not. Hey, 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 who is knocking on the door this late? I wonder if this game is like cursed. Like if you start playing it, you're gonna, you're gonna die. Just gotta make sure they're not knocking on the bathroom door. You know, everyone has a door inside of their bathroom, right? I just wanna check it out. Um, can we turn off the light? No one's home! Why would you open the door? And you invited it in. Okay, no one's out here. I should have heard wrong. Continue playing. You're very bossy. And kind of a bad walker. Don't panic. Because it's not going to get us in-game. It's going to get us 
in the game or it's gonna get us in real life that's gonna be that's gonna be the trick there's nothing that's gonna get us in the game our characters playing I can move a lot faster when I also do the arrow key like when you hold down two keys at a time so what do you want from me what do you want what do you what is this oh it's very dark but I don't know what to do do I try to go back through that door maybe hmm yeah is that what you want it's like pac-man but we're pac-man why can I sprint so fast in real life and not in this one in this little game and this is why you shouldn't play horror games kids oh hey hey I didn't see anything I didn't see anything it's fine what's this what's this I can turn a wheel probably e e, e. E. Is something coming up behind us? Oh, cool. Doors open. <laughs> Still can't sprint. But I can't go faster. I can't see, and I don't want to. Just so. Oh. I thought something was. <laughs> that scared me worse than the other game with the shower, I feel like. I should check the fuse box behind the house to escape. F for flashlight that is having me carrying around in my pocket. You need that for your shower area. This is a terrible, terrible idea. <laughs> I'm gonna make a dumb comment. This is gonna this is gonna show how much I don't know. Someone's gonna be keep dashing at us there's no reason we can run this fast do whatever you have to do how can you just fix the fuse box here's the dumb comment for well, it's already inside the house it doesn't matter now do you not have an electrical box inside of your house that you could probably try flickering a couple of times because like every time the power's ever gone out at my house i've never thought oh i'm gonna go check outside i go check on inside and then i i don't know call the power company or do Google search to see if it's out in the whole neighborhood. Just shut the door. It doesn't matter, actually. It just I just know it doesn't matter. You picked a cursed game. And that's why I always make sure my games aren't cursed. You gotta pay extra for the, um, the non-cursed games. This guy made a mistake. Alt. It's just a clock. And that's why you also shouldn't have clicky clocks. Okay. Dice. Flush the dice. There's lots of dice everywhere. What do I what do I do about that? Oh, okay. Under the bed. That stove looks an awful lot like our stove. And that table looks an awful lot like our table. Can the fridge open through us? Let's find out. No, it pushes out of the way. It's not our fridge. Under the bed. Under the bed. I just want to be very, very clear. I'm not <laughs> I'm not checking under the bed. IRL in the game. Four. I have to. This is such a dumb idea. Oh my good lord. Help us all. Hello, I know you're in there. Knock, knock. <laughs> that should not have scared me as bad as it did. I'm so sorry. God and everyone. I, I do apologize. But you don't think that that's a little weird? You're just going to keep playing the game? At that point, I would rather take my chances outside. I'm not kidding. I'm going out. Bye. Chair, fridge, table, toilet. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Just plug your ears if you want to be able to hear after we're done playing this game. Sorry, my hands are shaking. I already forgot. Chair, fridge, table, toilet. That didn't think I'd be saying anything in that order today. Chair, fridge, table, toilet. Chair, fridge, table, toilet. Chair, five. 
We were playing Catan recently and I kept not being able to read the dice correctly. It was so embarrassing. I don't know what's wrong with me sometimes. Chair, fridge, table, toilet. Why do I keep checking the camera little like pull out thing to see if something's behind me? Stop. What's that, four? That'd be super embarrassing if I can't read the dice again. But with everyone, all of you guys here too. Chair, fridge, table, toilet. We're gonna get caught. I don't think we're making it out of this. Why can we run so fast if we're not gonna get chased? Seven. Oh, I don't want to. Oh, there's a fancy toilet with the buttons on the top. You're very rich, aren't you? Should I be brave? I'm so brave. 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 I thought something was under the desk. <gasps> Seven. <sighs> okay. <sighs> See, if you serpentine, you can move faster. And that's what I'm talking about. Do, I, do we want to move faster to our impending doom? This is not gonna end well. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Uh, hug the wall. Where am I going? I'm in a box. Nothing happened. Serpentine backwards. Serpentine back. So much faster than just going straight. Serpentine. What? I think I hear something shuffling behind me, but I don't want it. I don't- Oh, I somehow- No. No. I did go down here. You jerk. Confusing me. Did I- What am I not triggering? Besides pain in the back. It wants me to look. I'm gonna squint. Hello? Oh! Yeah, that's what I wanted. It wanted it, it. Oh gosh, it's so dark in here. He left though. I'm outside. <gasps> I'm outside. No. Something skittering to the right. I just know it. I don't care if you eat me. Just eat me. What was that? I didn't even get a good look at it. No. <laughs> that was so freaky oh my gosh that was so cool we need a hundred more horror games like this i mean not the exact same but we need more games like this that was that was really good and really creative oh my goodness i'm a little unnerved i liked that a lot more please all right guys to round out this horrifying experience we're gonna play one more this one is called death trips and it's supposed to be an extremely short horror game but we'll be the judge of that let's play the game october 31st 2008 inspector m james is in a hunt for a serial killer called lady death the last victim of this dreadful criminal was found in this cheap hotel where lady james is currently investigating unfortunately for the inspector the murderer is still there what have I picked? This isn't... This is not by far the worst hotel I've ever stayed in. Or even a motel. Like, this is... Okay, the door, maybe. Maybe. Anything? Nothing. It's supposed to be extremely short, so we'll see how long I can drag this out. Nothing. Yeah, this is not by far the worst hotel I've ever stayed in, so... I don't know what this guy's used to. Okay. Can we- Are we going out? Are we staying in? What, what? I don't have any nice instructions like the other one up in the corner. I guess we're going up. Oh! Oh! There's- There's no buttons. We're just going. What happened? Was there a fire? Did your middle school volcano blow up? What is going on? Oh, you can sprint. That's good. Probably gonna need it. 
Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What? I don't know what to do. I'm stuck. Did she just trip? Like, actually... <laughs> that was extremely short. <laughs> Hold on. Do you think that I could sprint up to her? Like, in time for her to trip? Let's see. Let's see. Because she, she trips, like, right here, right? Come get me. That's hilarious. That is so funny. I'm so glad we ended on this. This was great. All right, guys, that is it for our scary game-a-thon. I wanna know in the comments down below, which was your favorite scary game? I think mine was The Horror Within. It really got me a few times and I was not expecting it to do that. It was super creative and really cool. As always, I hope that you're having a great day and I hope that you continue to have a great day. Stay tuned, cause there will be more. Bye for now.